Hi guys, this is Ashley back with another video. Before we get into the video, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications. So we're going to start off with Nikki and Foxy Brown. Now you guys have been sending me a video of this guy talking about Foxy Brown speaking badly about Nicki Minaj through DMs, okay? And it's kind of been all over YouTube. Um, and Foxy has yet to really clear anything up. Now she called Nicki Minaj a fraud and I will have the video, the link to the video in the description box. Okay. Cause I don't remember the guy's name, but anyway, with that being said, I did get back that there is an issue. Okay. Now I was reluctant to really speak on it because I just feel like, Oh no, Nicki First Candy, now Foxy. You got to get your girl group, your girlfriends together. You got to have them around, okay? You got to get your click back in order, okay? Because you don't have a lot of industry friends. But I did get back that, you know, her and Foxy have fell out before and they're always hot and cold. The same way she is with Candy and the same way she is with Drake. So this is not shocking and that they will probably make up. Okay, that's what I got back. Um, the reason for the rift is from Foxy's side, not Nikki's, Foxy's side, she does feel like the relationship is a little one-sided. You know, she always reaches out to Nikki. She reached out to Nikki when, you know, um, Nikki was pregnant, gave her a gift, always shouts her out. But she does feel like the relationship is one-sided, okay? Like she put in more energy and time into the relationship than Nikki does. Um, another thing is Foxy would like to have Nikki on the album. You know, Foxy is releasing an album later this year. Hopefully it comes out and um, she would like Nikki on the album. Foxy was also on Queen, the thing is, you know, does she have the money to pay Nikki? Probably not, okay? And I got back months ago that Nikki really doesn't want to do free features anymore. But, you know, she did say Foxy was like a sister to her. Um, you know, she's an inspiration to Foxy. And we all know the real reason why Foxy want Nikki on her album because of streams it's gonna help with streams the barbs are gonna buy it even if this song is not something that they would particularly listen to she knows the barbs are gonna buy it okay but like i said before nikki's trying to stay away from doing free features okay but i think she would do it for foxy she just hasn't gone around to it and they're not really on the best page Moving on to another reason why Foxy feels a type of way with Nikki is because of the whole Little Kim and Nicki Minaj making up, okay? Now, from what I hear, they haven't fully um, made up yet, but Little Kim's team has been reaching out to Nicki Minaj, okay? And... With that being said, a lot of people are pressuring Nicki Minaj to make up with Little Kim because they feel like it would be good for the culture. Now, it would be good for the culture, but it would not benefit Nicki Minaj at all. What benefit does Nicki have by doing a versus with Lil' Kim? She would only get a bag from it. That's really all it would be. It'd be good for the culture. Everybody's going to talk about it. People are going to get trending. You know, Lil' Kim will probably release a song. It probably would be the highest debut, you know, in the last 10 years of her career. Um, because we know that she's not popping now. Musically, you know, she's a legend. She's on the Mount Rushmore of female rappers of all time. But... Musically, she's not relevant. And all the Little Kim fans can get upset, but you allowed her to sell a thousand copies first week. And prior to that, she was selling her album on PayPal. Didn't Nikki say in a song, it sucks that you have to sell your album on PayPal? I remember that. 
Okay? So anytime somebody got to do stuff like that, you know they're not really that hot. Okay? With that being said, relevancy is important. And Nikki is more relevant right now than Lil' Kim. So, Foxy and Lil' Kim are not cool. And that's one of the reasons why Lil' Kim don't want to battle Foxy. And so, with that being said, Foxy would not be happy if Lil' Kim and Nikki made up. Okay? That's what I got back. She would not be happy at all she doesn't like these whispers of little kim reaching out even though nikki has not confirmed anything she doesn't want little little kim and nikki to make up now what y'all told me in the comments was you know they had gotten to some kind of altercation and people could have gotten hurt and that's pretty serious so i understand but she wants Nikki to have loyalty. And she's already side-eyeing Nikki. And she feels like I stood by you through the hate train. When nobody was messing with you. Okay? When all the other older rappers were dissing you. Queen Latifah. Um, who else? Lil' Kim. Remy Ma. You know, me and Lady Luck. We were, you know, sticking up for you. All the other ones were talking bad about you in interviews and stuff like that. So she wants Nikki to have some sort of loyalty towards her, especially when it comes to the Little Kim situation and the verses. Now, Little Kim only want to do a verses with Nikki because she don't like Foxy. So the reason why it's not already, you know, genuine. But I said earlier um, this year, well, in May, that little Kim wanted to make up with Nikki. Okay? And I'll put that video in the description box too. But Foxy wants Nikki to confirm that she is not doing the verses or making up with Lil' Kim. Now, Nikki has not yet confirmed anything. Maybe once she starts doing interviews, she might confirm it. But she hasn't confirmed and Foxy hasn't spoken to Nikki. And Nikki hasn't said anything to her. So she feel like, you know, if you do this, you're going to betray me. Because you know I'm not rocking with her. And just how you're not rocking with Cardi, I'm not rocking with Cardi. Foxy don't mess with Cardi because of Nikki. So... The talk of loyalty has come into play. Now, do I think that they will make up? Yes. Nikki always has these types of relationships with Candy, Drake, G Wayne, Birdman. She always have these up and down relationships. But can Nikki use the excuse business is business, especially if she get a bag for it when it comes to the verses? Like, listen, I only got to be there for a few hours. Kiki with Lil' Kim. Tell her how much she means to me. You know, talk to her for a few hours. You know, we can even have a conversation beforehand. Is it business is business? Or should she have loyalty for uh, Foxy? Okay, same thing that she was doing it with Cardi B. If her and Cardi do a record together. Is it business is business? But anyway, I was told that Foxy do feel some type of way towards Nikki. Okay, especially right now for those reasons. Um, you know, I'm still waiting to see what Nikki really does because I really do feel like her and Lil' Kim could possibly make up. Okay, Foxy not going to be happy about that, okay, because there's a lot of issues, I guess, her and uh, Kim got, you know, I thought it was just competition. Oh, my goodness. Uh, maybe she will say, you know, I'm rocking with Foxy, and until Foxy and Kim talk, you know, I'm not rocking with Kim, okay, or I'm not going to talk to Kim. But, you know, if people keep asking her and she keep, you know, running away from it or not really addressing Kim in any way, shape or form, 
then people are going to say Nikki is bitter and jealous and she don't want to make amends. She don't want to be with other female rappers. You know, other female rappers have reached out to Nikki, like Koi Ray, City Girls, Cardi. And the fact that she turned all of them down, people do side eyed her for that. So Nikki got a tough decision to make. I would not want to be here right now. Okay, you know, I think it'd be good for the culture. Is it good for her relationship with Foxy? Not really. And it she don't not going to benefit from it. So we just got to stay tuned, like, comment and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications. If I hear anything else, I will let y'all know. Have a great day.